Hello again. Uh, this lesson I would like to just kind of go into formulas a little bit more. Um, you'll use formulas throughout your report to make it do stuff, do certain things and stuff like that. Uh, here we have the formula workshop open. I wanted to show these two panes. They kind of have all the different uh, functions and operators that can be used in crystal reports to get what you want in your formula. So for example, you could highlight it wherever your cursor is, it just throws it down into the into the actual code. Now there's a couple of different websites that I use to get a better understanding of what these uh, different operators and functions do. This is one of them, techofthenet.com. This is a Oracle PL SQL syntax. You'll have to use it in conjunction with SQL Developer. You will use SQL Developer along with Crystal Reports uh, to do troubleshooting and stuff like that, or to do SQL statements. Uh, if you don't know how to use SQL, I just highly recommend getting a little bit of understanding of how it works. It'll help you out a lot. I also have this IBM website that I use that shows me different, uh, just gives me descriptions of each one of the functions and stuff like that. So. This is this right here is an example of a relatively small if then statement. You can see that the the green has little double forward slashes. That represents comments. This is just for for me. And as you all know, you should comment your stuff so that when you go back, you can understand where you're at. Um, so this if then statement says if this this uh, department represents a parameter. We'll get into parameters later, but it has a question mark in front of it, so that means it's a parameter. If it equals 14, then blah, blah, blah. Here's the rest of your, your code. So that's a little bit about formulas. Thanks for watching.